Hi, back to 7 days to die. It's day 6, uh, night time. Tomorrow will be day 7, so you'll be able to see how, how well this, uh, how well this base holds up. So tomorrow I'll be spending my time showing up the defenses, uh, blocking off the ramp. Then we'll see how it goes. We will need more cobblestone rod to do repairs. We'll need more arrows to fend off the zombies, and we will need uh, water. I should have built more arrow sticks, I guess. Because the the only one now that I have is at the front. That means I can't really shoot uh, arrows from inside the house, only from the top, which is quite safe, I guess. Let's see. Uh, in the meanwhile, let's <coughs> continue making cobblestone blocks. I can make 308, but let's go with 150. I prefer to leave some stones for my own self, so that I can make, um, make tools when I need to. Uh, going well. One, two, I'll need one more copper stop for you. Oh, by the way, I'm be on reservist for this week, so there won't be any new videos until I come back from reservist. What happens when your your country needs you to serve in the military? It's a compulsory thing. Nothing we can do about it. So yeah. Just have to put in my last frame and it will be done. Let's see my food and water. Uh food 57, water 63. Okay, we'll have to make some food and water. Bacon and eggs is always better than just chopped meat. And eggs are not that difficult to come by. I'll need water as well. Yes, it should be enough. So my last cobblestone frame will be here. After tomorrow night, uh, after tonight actually, now it's day 7, after tonight I'll be planning my expansion. I'm thinking uh, since 
this space is not big enough for what I will need to expand. I will build a new base nearby and connect it using a uh, walkway. So I can run between tower towers when I need and there won't be the prime spots between the towers will be minimized. That means if uh, the zombies are attack attacking one tower, you can run over to the next tower and pick them off. Okay, I'm gaining back my wellness that I lost when I died uh, the last few videos. Here you can see my wellness is at 87 from the when I spawned at 100. That means I died twice. Because every time I die, the wellness will drop by 10. So I have 30 more to gain back until I reach the middle point. I'm at level 9, food 74, water 60. So water, I'll probably have to stock up. Golden rod tea. Golden rod tea would be much better than just hot water. And there's a lot of golden rod around my base, so I'm not very bothered about using using resources to make golden rod tea. One more. Oh, yeah, it takes about 4 minutes. It's kind of long. But luckily, I have a lot of wood. Uh, so, no problems here. Put the rock power. I should probably put snow berries into the chest. So, I have cobblestones, wood, uh, plant fiber, the uh, I don't need dirt. Stones and clay. Mm, let's do some inventory management. The fragment, nitrate powder, coal, gunpowder, and the ground. No four and Roy. For the rest, I guess uh, the useless ones, the ones that I don't smell, just let iron. Is there any iron? No iron. Iron. Just let iron. Oh, there's two more bottled water here. You can use them. Oh, yeah, food. Oh, golden rod. Crop fragments. Since I have so much cough fragments. Oh yeah, I can be really doing more cutting now. I mean the my armor I, I guess I could use them to level up my armor tailoring crafting. But let's see what else are there in the, in the chest that we have to take note of. From me I have a lot of pistol parts, but hmm, without the knowledge on how to make pistols, I can't really do anything much with them. Uh, these two are just 
use for trading, which I can't do it now. Arrow K is one of which is not going to help a lot. The only thing oh, I know how to make with paper is from the bus ammo, which is like which is like a short range shotgun. Let's blunder bus blunder bus Mother ammo effective at very close range. How close is close is is really very close. You practically have to be at movie range for it to be effective. That's why I have never never really used blunderbuss. The amount of forged iron it takes to make one blunderbuss is also too much for it to be a vulnerable weapon. Although it's much easier to make than the other weapons like pistol and shotgun. You, all these all these items that you use to make the blunder bus can be used for better better um, weapons. It's just not worth. I mean, even the bow is is a good weapon, good enough weapon. Once you once you master it, so yeah. Nice three thirty. Let's see. Maybe I need some more food. Mm. I can't make any more bacon, but let's just cook the raw meat. A lot of golden rods. Yeah, I'm supposed to have one more. A lot of golden rod tea. I don't have. Uh, you see, golden rod teach with you stamina 40 and wellness plus 0 0.2 and remove dysentery 1. Well, these are much better than water which just give you stamina 20, hydration 20, and remove burning. If you see plants that you can use to make drinks, do it, just do it. Arrow seeds. I need emails for storage, so can't do any of that. Uh, animal pets. I guess I can use them to make more. Make more tallow. It's easy to come by for me, so I have no problem with food. Oh, let's see. Almost daytime, 439, 440. I guess I could have one more chest. Or should I just make an arrow sleep here? Okay. I'll just make one more chest for my weapons.
I can't use them yet, of course, but uh, I want to prevent them from copying up my my chest here. Ammo will be low, I guess. Separate them. Oh, it looks much cleaner now. I guess I'll need a lot more arrows for night. Five twenty. Now oh, what the hell? There is five twenty. Twenty nine thirty. Uh, we'll see you in the next video for my uh, daytime planning for day seven night hot. Okay, see you guys.